Erica, good afternoon. The morning began with the jury hearing highly scientific, highly technical testimony about DNA and how it proves what the defense already admits that Philip Chisholm raped Colleen Ritzer before he killed her. But the most powerful testimony today, the most powerful witness so far, a close friend who spoke with Colleen Ritzer moments before the murder. Tearful testimony this morning from one of Colleen Ritzer's fellow math teachers at Danvers High School. Sarah Gia Quinta and Colleen Ritzer were more than colleagues. They were friends. So close that on October 22nd, 2013, the day of the murder, Sarah dressed as Colleen for Dress Like Your Friend Day during school spirit week. Ritzer is seen here on the left talking with Gia Quinta in the hallway after school. Moments before Philip Chisholm followed Ritzer into the bathroom, where his defense team admits he raped and murdered her. Gia Quinta told the jury that Chisholm was one of the topics the two teachers talked about briefly in the hallway. What did Colleen say to you um, just about why the boy was in her classroom? She said, I don't know why he's here. Late this morning, the doctor who performed the autopsy on Colleen Ritzer showed the jury the purple top Ritzer was wearing when Chisholm killed her. Chisholm sat silently through the testimony, including when the doctor detailed for the jury some of the severe injuries he inflicted on Colleen Ritzer. To the neck area, there were 12 stab wounds and four incised wounds. So the prosecution is continuing to present its case. The defense obviously hasn't started yet. Even so, the case, the trial itself, is moving much faster than anticipated. It is possible that the jury could begin deliberations by the end of next week.